guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episodes three and four of a Kebby Chan Silly Uniform. So, yes, unfortunately for me, it's been the last time that I watched episodes one and two was almost like a week ago. And so I tried to, I was going to binge all of this, which this is the plan that I'm doing now. Um last week after I watched episodes one and two that one following Sunday where I barely really had anything to do um but because I was so busy these last two weeks I was like I have no time and so since I don't have to go to work tomorrow I was like we're gonna go ahead and make time so this is going to take me five hours to finish this whole freaking series and by the time we get to like two or three o'clock in the morning, I still have two more things to do and I gotta get that done. But I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get that done. So even though, yeah, it's been a week, I really don't remember everybody's name. So this will be like a second introduction for me with these characters. But other than that, let's go ahead and get started on episode three and three, two, one, go. I love how she's just like listening to all the conversations. Okay, Bee, your turn. What's wrong? Oh, she's bare for. I can't be like, you know what? I'm gonna smoke all these bitches to death. <laughs> Woo, get ready to hear this opening several times, DJ, because we for the next five hours. Since today is literally the only day I can record this. But it's worth it for all those people who are asking me, Deja, Queen, Queen, Deja, babe, can you watch this? <laughs> it's worth it. So I'm glad you guys are happy about this, even though it'll be, it's going to be a little weird because I've only watched this for like two days now and it'll be just like that. <laughs> it'll be like a week and a couple of days. And I really hope you guys like, enjoy it i mean i know a lot of people enjoyed this when this was airing so and like i said a lot of people wanted to see my reaction on this and i was like i don't have time i'm busy with work and patreon stuff and non-patreon stuff do you <laughs> i have no time and then now when i do have time i'm really kind of like crunching it all together where i'm like let me just get the whole show done binge it in a day or two or three or four days because originally i was gonna try to get this done in like two, three days, but. Exactly, honey, I mean, damn. That doesn't mean you should run barefoot all the time though. Yeah. Possible bullies. Mm. 
Do you want her to join the track team? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, 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 uh. Well, of course, with a run like that, I mean, damn, everyone's gonna be like, "Hey, Cappy Chan, ma'am." Oh my god. <laughs> episode one was all about feet. Episode two was all I mean episode two. Episode one and two were all about feet. Episode three and four are all about legs. <laughs> But you don't like that, do you? Yeah, but you have like a leadership role. It just happens. It's good, ain't it?
Oh, come on. There's something everyone likes. <laughs> huh? Oh, look how shy she is around her. And see, some tells me she might be for the other team it wouldn't surprise me I mean how they go to an all girls school so it's bound to happen You're seriously not going to send her a picture of your legs, are you? I mean... Mm -hmm. She is? Yeah, I mean, there's nothing weird about taking pictures of your legs, but just seriously, like, oh. I'm scared. Oh shit, she sent it. No! Mm. Oh! My world about dead. <laughs> That really happened. Okay. Yeah, this is this is a we're going into Yuri territory with this. Mm-hmm. So now it makes me kind of wonder, like, are we going to see a lot of moments between a Kevy and Kay, possibly?
Oh, we're made gymnastics. Okay. Why do I feel like she might be like, oh, I want to make my own club? I don't know. I mean, it, it's just, you have that feeling, you're like, hmm. Oh. Do you have a spare change of clothes? And this is why, as us girls, also women, when you get older, always, always, always bring a change of clothes just in case. How, like, with me today, I got slurpy on me, and so I have to go buy the shirt. I'm guessing you get nervous. Let me also say this. I feel like all the girls in this show, and this is kind of really more of looking, think about episode one and two, every single girl in this show is going to fall for it, Gabby. In some way, shape, or form. But they're not going to admit it. It's pretty flowers. Can we talk about, like, how much, like, just, like, literally with her neck? Like, that that was a really beautiful shot, but, like, oh, it was, like, look at that.
Yeah, most definitely. All these girls are going to fall in love with her in some way, shape, or form. So, technically, she got, what, four girls in her arm right now? Oh, I thought we were ending it for the episode, and we'll find out in episode four. But, I already found the club. Really? Of course. <laughs> I mean, that makes sense because she's really good at, like, portraying different emotions and acting and such. But, yes, very good episode. Oh, my God. But once again, this girl is making every freaking girl in this classroom almost fall in love with her. We're on episode three. Episode three. I can't even imagine, like, what the hell this is going to look like in four hours from now when I'm in the final two episodes and I'm tired and I'm trying to stay up because, uh, no, it'll be two o'clock, so probably three. Yeah, by three o'clock I should be sleepy. Um, but it's just going to be very interesting to see how much she's truly grown as a character from episode three to the finale of this show. But yeah, I thought it was interesting. I mean, to have this episode still focus on her, but to not have a Kebby be the quote unquote main focus of this episode was really interesting. I love the fact that we're getting to know a little bit more about the rest of the girls as much as also seeing a Kebby's on also, you know, getting developed every single week. And so I think that's really good because there's always certain companies and studios who have like original animes and they have a group of maybe let's say three to four to five girls in like the first half of the show. And then we get to October and then we add one more girl and then it's hard enough to give freaking development for every single girl in the damn show. Okay, series. Yeah, if you know what I'm talking about, you know what I'm talking about. If you don't, little hint, hint. It's a magical girl anime, and it's one of the, like it. It's like a. It's very popular, very very popular magical girl anime. And no, it's not Sailor Moon. Yes, it's as popular as Sailor Moon, but it's not. It, it's been running for a really long time. That's all I'll say. And plus, I've reacted to several seasons of this show. <laughs> Of it. So once again, if you know, you know. But I really thought this was a very interesting episode. I mean, was I expecting the, you know, um, the photo and ish and that? And, and yeah, was not expecting that. I mean, cause like it, it's still in a weird way, it is still a fan servicey as show, um, and such, especially with still thinking about the first episode and. The girl, the blind girl doing what she did and stuff and how I was like, what 
is this like straight up and, and like i said once again when i want when i saw that out of context i was like yeah i'm not gonna watch this show and now look how the tables have turned ladies and gentlemen uh, um, but yeah, I think it's really cute. I, I'm really glad. Like, once again, we're getting other things, um, episodes focusing on different girls. So I do hope we get to see an episode on the one short girl. I think her name is Hotaru and such. Because, I, like, honestly, I feel like her episode is going to be, like, mwah, the best out of all of them. But go ahead and pause the video, and I will see you guys in one second for episode four. Okay, episode four and three, two, one, go. We're not talking about that mobile one. Yeah, she, she does not want to talk about that one. Yeah, you're very photogenic, Cubby. And there she goes. Mm-hmm. Spike. Mm-hmm. 
gorgeous. Oh. It's a really good shot. <laughs> a pretty one. Oh! <laughs> Do you want her to dance? Is that what you will possibly see for your image, guy? Or playing in the water? <laughs> Yeah, I mean, since you're with her. pictures. Cause she liked it a lot. Oh, isn't that funny?
Oh. On both feet. Bunny ears? So basically she sleeps like the dead. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, it suits you. It's cute. Both of your girlfriends are falling more in love with you. Hope it doesn't stain. Hmm? Of course, who doesn't like sweets? Macadamia nuts. She's gonna wake up to the smell of cookies.
<laughs> she is eating all of them. Right? But you still try them. Oh my god. Kay over here drinking a drink for a hot minute.
So she sees that wave every day. my thumbnail because hmm. I kept wondering where that was from but I was like yeah let me use this this is cute and harmless no it was from today's episode oh my god but yeah the pictures that she took were gorgeous like I mean once again like there's a lot of animes that have always had that one shot or shots in every single episode or maybe even in a couple episodes I mean you know dress up darling had like every single they had a shot or a moment where it was just like I just want to blow that the fuck up and hang that off my wall that's the same thing with like okay if any of you have played either persona 5 or persona 5 R and know who Yusuke is Yusuke is an artist of course there is this like one art there's two different arts that he's done and one of them is kind of, and, like, the fandom is a little more popular than the other one. And when one of my favorite YouTubers finally played P5, um, he loved the crap out of that art. And he wanted, like, a big picture blown up like that. And he was, like, <laughs> he was ready, ready to put some money down for that. I mean, it probably, depending on, like, what how big you want it and such. Yeah, it probably cost you, like, a lot of money. I, I cannot imagine. But, like, would I pay a lot of money for that? Oh, of course, because that was a beautiful art. Beautiful piece of work of art that I would love to see and hang up on my wall. But, yeah, this episode was so good. I love the fact that we got to see the girls' dorm. I mean, because that was something that I was wondering ever since, like, episode one to a little bit of three as well and such but yes i thought it was really sweet and then we getting getting to see what Teresa's roommate and the majority of the time she was asleep of course how when she woke up she kind of reminded me of tomoyo from car Captain sakura like oh i can't but yeah even Kay's freaking photo album of the friend the first issue is so pretty like oh they, like, Cloverworks is like, you know, yeah, we were going in with Darling, but we're really going in with this show. I mean, these shots of this and the animation on this and the qualities, even the still images are gorgeous pieces, works of art. And it's just like, like, once again, I buy it. Name your price. You know, what? No, well, hold on, hold on, wait, wait, wait. Name your price a little under $1,000. Yeah, 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 yeah. Under a thousand dollars, and like, you know, you can't call me. Yeah, 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 yeah. But it was a good episode. I really liked it. And hell, I mean, yeah, you you would automatically assume that, like, ever since episode one, kind of two, that Akebi has been, like, this perfect esque um, child and thinking that she's good at everything. But I love the fact that she's not really perfect because no one is perfect. We're, we're good at some things, but we're not good at everything. No one is perfect at every little freaking thing that they do. I'm good at cooking. I, I, I love cooking and I love baking and it's like that. But even at work, I will make mistakes. And sometimes, you know, I can fix it and sometimes I can't. And it happens. You know, we all make mistakes and we're just human and that's just it. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episodes three and four of A Kevy Town Sailor Uniform. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Oh my god! Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next time for episodes 5 and 6. Bye, guys.